Dang, I didn't mean to frighten her. She'll be back though, hopefully. Poor girl. I nearly put the stake in her when I was putting it, moving that stake. I was just about to stomp it into the ground and I suddenly saw her. So, luckily I saw her at the last minute. She'll be back. I'll check on her. I don't know where she went. Took off. Didn't like me disturbing her nesting site. I don't blame her. All the uh, goldfinch are flocking about the place. Swallows are dashing around all over this field. It's hard to see them all, but there's loads and loads of them flying around. And then the goldfinches are all along here. There's a flock of about 20 or 30 that uh, are eating the grasses the grass seeds along the verges here. And here's one of the scabias is about to come out. This is a uh, lady's bed straw, purple clover, some two different kinds of uh, dandelions or hawkweeds. Here is some uh, bird's foot trefoil. So you can see there's a large variety of stuff here. And the bird life is magnificent at the moment. So are the butterflies. The butterflies are very hard to film because they flit about as you walk through the grass. But you can see, I don't know if you can see on the film, the swallows all racing around along there. And this lime tree and that lime tree, that lime tree right there, are humming are absolutely humming with bees and pollinators, bumblebees and honeybees and everything. So it's a very busy place here at the moment with all kinds of animal life feeding. Look, there's another different kind of dandelion. And look, here's a yarrow. That's a baby yarrow. More bird's foot trefoil down there. This is a beautiful one that's orange. So yeah, wildlife is very busy here at the moment. And I'm sorry I disturbed that pheasant. I'm trying to do it as quietly as possible. I'll check on her later. She'll probably go back. So I kept the dogs all the way over there. Ah, 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 ah. Stay there. Stay. And um, as you can see, I checked where the pheasant had returned to her nest after, sadly, I gave her such a fright she left it. But she returned. And she's right in there. Still. You can just about see her eye right there. And I'm going to leave her be and make sure that all this long grass isn't grazed around the nest so that she can keep her privacy sheltered by the lime tree and the long grasses. <laughs> 